guys easy and everything where everything is easy and today I want to teach you uh, how you can like um, turn in your videos or movies or anything so that you can put them on your iPod touch your iPhone or your iPod or your iPad your Apple TV anything because uh, people have the trouble of uploading their videos or something and them being dot MOE and that does not work with any of your iDevices. So when you put that in iTunes and you sync your iPod, it will say that video will, would not be able to uh, download to your iPod because of something. But uh, how to fix that, get around that. Uh, you're just going to open up your video in iMovie and I uh, just have one right here. And this is actually my intro I was putting together a little while ago. That's my new one. Uh, you just saw it. Um, but yeah, this is, this is it. Right here. I made this in After Effects, so if any of you would request a tutorial, uh, I'll do one. You know? But, uh, anyway, um, what you're gonna do is you have your video made. Alright, I didn't, I took the music out just, you know, because I already have one with music. Uh, what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to Share. Export movie. Most people go to export using QuickTime. I usually do that too. But you want to go to export movie. Or export. And you get all of these options. You can do it to your computer. Pretty much works with anything. Um, works with your Apple TV, iPad, iPhone, and iPod. Uh, now if you have a lot earlier version of iMovie, you may not be able to do it with your iPad. Uh, your Apple TV. I don't know. I think that's always been there. Your iPod has always been there. But, uh, so, uh, if you have the newest version of iMovie, I have iMovie 11. But, you know, uh, uh, I recommend if you're doing it with your iPod, you're gonna have to go with Medium, no matter what. If you're doing it for your iPhone or iPad, you can go with any of these. Any of mobile, all the way to HD and 720p. I don't know why that's not showing up. But because mine doesn't, I'll just go to large, and that fits four out of five devices. I recommend large. And then just click export to your directory or whatever, and it will save it in a format like this. You see, I have mine as an M4V. And that, this is for my iPod Touch, and that should uh, mean that when you put it into iTunes and you sync it, it should work. And so, yeah, that's, that's about it, guys. Uh, thanks for watching, and remember, everything is easy.